This is an HIV at-home self-test kit available in Canada. How does it work? Let's find out. First thing you're gonna wanna do, open this baby up, then get out all of your materials. Keep that band-aid close. Line up your bottles. This one's a little harder to get out your little tray. Then you're gonna wanna open this up. And at first you might think, gosh, that's a lot of words. Give yourself a breather. The main ones you need to care about are these. Take a minute. You're gonna feel like you wanna drink. Don't do that. Read through this carefully so you can follow the directions as closely as possible. What I like to do, pro tip, is open the Band-Aid first because you only have two hands so you don't struggle through it. And it's ready. Open the bottle, get it ready for your blood. Here we go, time to do the finger prick. Take this off first. Make sure you get a good fleshy chunk. Side of the finger is optimal. And just press. And then milk it from the base. So you get a good little droplet. There we go. Now it's time to put on your Band-Aid. <laughs> Close the lid of step one firmly. Shake it four times. You really want to see this red color in the bottle before you pour it into the tray. Pour the liquid into the tray nice and slowly and wait for it to absorb. All right, now, bottle two. Pour the liquid into the tray. Get me. Lost a little. It's okay if you lose a little, just keep going with the test. Wait for the liquid to absorb again. And grab bottle number three. Pour the liquid in carefully if you can. And again, wait for the liquid to absorb. I think I know what I'm gonna get. As you can see, two dots. She's positive, HIV positive. The top dot might look a little faint, but as long as it's visible, the test is valid. And if you have one dot, you're HIV negative. So pedestrian.